hey, where is this Rockets player going? Like, I don't... You're not coming in backside help here, so why why are you in the paint? Like, what wh- what is the point of you being having a foot in the paint right now? So, so now you can't get back out and guard, and why? Okay, so Kevin Porter is playing on Jimmy Butler's side here. So Alperin Sangoon you're, is doing a double, but you cannot let Jimmy Butler turn the corner on your double team. I mean, look at this. You let him turn the corner, uh, that is not good. Okay, if you're Alperin Sangoon here, stop. You, okay, you can be in drop coverage, but you got to drop high with Tyler Harrow, okay? Like, get up here, get your feet set, get in a defensive stance. Like, you, you, this is horrible. Okay, the shot goes up. If you're Alperin Sangoon here, you got to use the lower half of your body to box out. That moves Udonis Haslam. You got to move Udonis Haslam. He can't be standing in the charge circle, or I mean, how easy is this? If this Rockets player is going to play on Tyler Harrow's side, you're saying, I can't guard Tyler Harrow, and that's okay. So Eric Gordon now is going to have to move over and get in the gaps. If your feet are set, you're in a defensive stance, uh, this player can... you got to play up on Tyler Harrow, okay? Obviously. But now I can force Tyler Harrow here, I can stunt, and I can recover, and I'm not giving up a three. But this is trash. Okay, if you're Eric Gordon right here, stop. Get in a defensive stance with your feet set. You have nothing but time to do so. Look at this. This Heat player isn't going anywhere. So why do you keep moving your feet everywhere? Like, look at this. You're just... All you've done is move your feet. This Heat player hasn't even dribbled. Like, wh- what? What? Garrison Matthews, you cannot lean towards this screen. Look at Garrison Matthews leaning towards the screen. Whoops. Well, Tyler Harrow... Now went the other way, and now you're off balance. So now when he actually comes off of the screen, you're never going to be able to get over the screen in time. How is Garrison Matthews going into this screen right here? How? Look at how much space there is to go over this screen. And you're going to go into, like, the area where the screen... Why? So now look. Now you're, you're off balance because God knows why. I mean... If you're Eric Gordon, just keep your feet set. You can start going over the screen when this player starts going over the screen. But look at Eric Gordon. Look how he's moving his feet upwards right there. So now he's playing off of his front foot. So when Tyler Harrow tries to come over this screen now, you're going to be forced to backpedal because you're off balance because you're playing off of your front foot. And now you're going to run into this screen, and now Tyler Harrow is open again. What is Kevin Porter doing? You're not a part of this ball screen. Could you please, like have some modicum of understanding of where your man Jimmy Butler is. Garrison Matthews is having quite the rough evening here. Okay, so uh, this Rockets player is going to rotate up. Jabari Smith's going to rotate up here. So this player is going here. You need to stay home here, obviously. Like, where is he going? What is Jabari Smith doing here? So this Rockets player is coming down to double. So stay out here. Like, box out your man. Why would you just, like, you just coming in to get a better look of this double team? So now when this block shot happens, where's the ball going? Because you didn't box out. Okay, this shot goes up. Stop when no one is boxing any Heat player out on the perimeter. A long rebound is for sure going to go to the offense. Backpedaling is not defense. Eric Gordon has nothing but time to get his feet set. Instead, what does he do? Backpedals. So what is the problem with you backpedaling? Well, because you are went this way, you're not going to be able to get over this screen. <laughs> wow. Come on, what is Jabari Smith doing here? Could you please stay up here? Like, why? why what, you're, you're not help. What are you doing? What is Jalen Green doing here? This ball gets deflected into the air. Okay, stop. Uh, Miami comes up with this ball. Great. So come over here and defend. Where's Jalen Green going? Okay, at some point in time, Jalen Green is going to have to start battling for position right here. Stop. So Jimmy Butler turns. Well, now's a good time. Get up, battle for position. Why not? Okay, uh, now's a good time, certainly, to battle for position. Uh, no? 
Okay, so we're just never going to then. Jalen Green cannot be feeling out this screen. Just guard. When um, this Heat player comes off this screen, now it's time to fight over the screen. Look at Jalen Green. Look at him feeling out the screen right now. Well, now you're not going to be able to get over the screen. I mean... So Jalen Green turns the ball over. Okay, it's fine. It happens. It's basketball. But right now, you cannot be worried about the ball. It's across half court. So somebody will get the ball. You need to be worried about this Heat player here. Like, I wish we shared that same worry. Okay, so the Rockets get this ball, and then there's a turn -off. Stop. So right now, it is certainly time for all three of these Rockets players, but in this case, especially Kenyon Martin Jr., to put on the break sign because uh, we don't know where this ball is going. So stay here so that you can, if the Heat come up with this ball, you can just simply come over here and guard. Uh, that is not exactly what happens. I mean, Terry Eason, again, this is Tyler Harrow. Like, you can drop and drop coverage, but you got to drop a little bit higher. It's Tyler Harrow. Just get your feet set in a defensive stance. You'll be fine. You'll be able to guard the ball, and then you can slide over to Duncan Robinson. But you can't be backpedaling with... with the this is absurd. Look oh, look at this. You are literally not going to be even seeing the ball. Look at this Rockets player anticipating a screen. Well, now that allows Tyler Harrow to spin off you. And now look. So now you're off balance. So now when Tyler Harrow does come off the screen, it doesn't even need to be a screen. This heat big doesn't even screen you because you're already beat. So that screws up everything you're trying to do in drop coverage. Okay, so horrendous offense can lead to impossible to guard defense. Jalen Green is going to leave his feet here. You cannot leave. He has no plan right now. He's not even seeing Alperin Sangoon, who he's intending to pass this ball to. So when you do that, you might be throwing this ball to the other team. What on earth is Jabari Smith doing? You guard this Heat player. Why on earth would you just stand here? Get up and guard. Look at this. What are you doing? So you're calling for a switch? Why? So you can just stand there like a statue?